So it's uh, Monday the 7th, I believe, of uh, November, and uh, we know that Biden's just won the election. <coughs> and, uh, well, it seems that way. It's going to what plan to what I thought it was going to go. I think it's still going to go that Trump's going to win in the courts, so we get that real letdown real uplifting of all the people having hope and then a real crash of their emotions and back onto the streets in rioting. It's going to be that dark winter when they declare Trump president again. Pre-programmed in uh, one of the computer games, I think it's called State of the Union. I saw a video on it the other day. I'm just down the field with Carlo, listening to uh, Ice Age Farmer, and a um, bit of Never Lose Truth, just seeing what's going on over there, but um, real interesting times, huh? Isn't it fascinating that so many people's hopes are put in someone like Joe Biden, a bumbling pedo? <laughs> that shows, you know, people can't even, like, think for themselves that they will rely on, on someone like that as their only hope. I personally believe Trump will get back in through the courts and uh, he'll end up fake assassinated. And then guess who's going to step up? Obama, no doubt. The silver-tongued devil. Anyway, I'm just enjoying a little bit of a nice day down here while we still got some sunshine. Hope you're all well and uh, hope you're looking up, praying, because this is a time of a replenishment. More than their great reset, this is a time for the coming of the kingdom of Yahusha, who people call Jesus. A name deliberately chosen to fit him with all the gematria to make him look bad by that system, that pagan system that comes out of Rome. Devils. Take care.